Hey guys, in this tutorial you will learn how to format a Raspberry Pi, Raspbian VC, SD card. Well, normally if you try to uh, uh, format the SD card from here, uh, right now I'm going to plug in the SD card. You'll see that this is what it is in the folder. So here, this is it. I mean, if I format it, well, I'll do it for you guys, and you'll see what happens. I want to do FAT32. This FAT default start. Okay. It formatted, but my space in there is more than 59 megabytes. I I know I have like four gigabytes. Of SD card so uh, the way to format it completely is by doing a little extra uh, what you gotta do is go to google.com and type SD card format oh formatter well this will take you the first link will be SD card.org slash download that's where you want to go so you go in there uh, this is something that you will need to download. So you click on uh, SD card formatted 4.0 for Windows download. Uh, so you click on I accept on the bottom. You scroll down and click on I accept. You save the file. And once it's downloaded properly, uh, completely, then you click on setup. Uh, Okay, so it's gonna go through the process. So here, so you click next, you install it completely. And you can see that it's still. Well, go through the process. Just click next for everything. We'll do the default setup. Uh, now you go here. You search for SD card, SD formatter. Well, once you open up SD formatter, it'll be on your desktop also, the, the, the shortcut to it. So, the only drive that I have inserted in is uh, drive F, which is 56 megabytes, this thing over here. But I know it is more than 56 megabytes, so I want to do a complete format of the whole. Uh, Want to full erase and size adjustment? Okay, on. So I want to click. So what you want to do is you want to have full erase and size adjustment on. So just click format. Click OK. And as you can see, it's doing a full format. And now it's saying it has a. 3.68 gigabytes which is correct which is about about as much as uh, this space that I think I have on the SD card about 4 gigabytes uh, now if you go to my computer you'll see it's 4 gigabytes uh, I hope this helped to you in some way I know it was a little tricky for me to figure out um, I was going to use uh, G parted and boot up from the G parted disk, but instead of that, I think this is much easier. You just install the software, and that's about it. All right, I hope it works for you. Okay, bye bye.